Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Certainly. NumberPy is a powerful library in Python that is widely used for numerical and scientific computing. One of the key features of NumberPy is its ability to handle various data types efficiently. This tutorial will cover the different data types in NumberPy, how to create arrays with specific types, and how to convert between types. Hashtag 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 1. Introduction to NumberPy Data Types NumberPy supports a variety of data types, types, which can be broadly categorized into integer types, int 8, int 16, int 32, int 64. Unsigned integer types, uint 8, uint 16, uint 32, uint 64. Floating point types, float 16, float 32, float 64, float 128. Complex types, complex 64, complex 128. Boolean type, bool. String type, str or unicode. Object type, object. Void type, void. Hashtag 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 2. Creating number pi arrays with specific data types. You can create a number pi array with a specific data type by using the dip parameter when creating the array. Hashtag 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 3. Checking the data type of an array. You can check the data type of a number pi array using the dot type attribute. Hashtag 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 4. Type conversion. Number pi provides functions for converting between different data types. You can use the dot as type method to cast an array from one type to another. Hashtag 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 5. Summary of common data types. Int 8, 8 bit signed integer. In 16, 16 bit signed integer. In 32, 32 bit signed integer. In 64, 64 bit signed integer. Uint 8, 8 bit unsigned integer. Float 32, 32 bit floating point. Float 64, 64 bit floating point. Complex 64, 64 bit complex number. Bool, Boolean type. Object, Python object type. Hashtag 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 conclusion. NumPy's ability to handle different data types efficiently makes it a powerful tool for numerical computing. By understanding and utilizing these types, you can optimize memory usage and improve performance in your scientific computing tasks. Feel free to experiment with the code examples provided above. If you have any questions or need further assistance, don't hesitate to ask.